All right, so today we're going to do a lab activity on testing Archimedes' principle. We learned about it, that a submerged object is buoyed up by a force equal to the weight of the water it displaces. We're going to see how that works and get ready for a lab quiz tomorrow. So today we have our balance hanging up in the air. We're going to be asking you to test three different materials. We'll be doing a golf ball, a piece of wood, and a rock. So the first thing you're going to do is determine the mass of the object in the air. You just do it like the thing, where you uh, very carefully move your riders. Okay. And get the mass. And make sure you carefully record the mass then. In this case, it looks like the mass is 46.3. Okay, now we want the mass of the displaced water. So, we have to use our overflow can again. And, let's go ahead and do that. So we get our over can all ready to go. There we go. Make sure the graduated cylinder is empty. Put it under there. Then remove the object from the balance. Please hold it by the hook with the tweezers and slowly lower it so that it doesn't flow out the top. Slowly lower it in there. And then you get the displacement. Now remember, the mass of this water is equal to the upward buoyant force pushing on that, making it seem lighter. So as I read this, it looks like it is, wow, amazingly, 40. So the mass of the water displaced is 40 grams. Now, the way you predict the submerged mass is real easy. It weighs 46.3 in air. If it's in water, the buoyant force is pushing up with a force of 40 grams. So you just simply subtract 40 from 46.3, and that means when that thing's underwater, it should weigh about 6.3 grams. Now, the way you test this is to actually do it. So we predicted it. Put some water in our big cup there. Get our golf ball back out. Hang it back up on the string thing. Okay. Then we need to very carefully lower it in the water. Now when we put it in the water, we have to make sure it is not touching the sides of the cup has to be suspended right in the center as best we can. And notice that the hook is partially under or above the water. So let's go ahead and just top that off. So we will have that thing suspended in there nicely. And now we're predicting it'll weigh 6.3 grams, which is the difference between the mass in air and the, and the mass of the displaced water. So <clears throat> I move this to zero. I put that at 6.3, and ladies and gentlemen, that is amazing. That weighs 6.3 grams in the water. By golly, Archimedes was correct. Woohoo! Do that with the piece of wood and with the rock. Make sure you practice this technique. Make sure you understand it. Tomorrow you'll be given a mystery object. You'll have to be able to predict the mass. <clears throat> I will tell you then what the actual submerged mass is. And depending on how close you are, determines your grade. All right, go back and.